Lord. It's my honor to be here this, uh, this afternoon. Um, I'm Michael from India. My dad is a pastor and I grew up in, in the church. Uh, but later on my life changed and I was into drugs and God has saved me through the sickness that I, I had because I lost my lungs which, which was just working 40% and God has met this uh, bloody man uh, in the deathbed and he gave me a new life and the doctors then checked and told uh, that my lung is looking like an infant's lung. So, so God has healed me completely. And I went to the Bible school. When I, when I, when I see uh, Bible students like this, I, I'm so glad. Because um, while starting the Bible school, I was so playful. I was so playful. I was not in the class because uh, I was into media. And, uh, you know, uh, uh, even in the meetings, I was with a camera and the, with the PA system. Uh, because I did my... Uh, my, uh, my sound engineering, so I was able to do that. Uh, most of the times I was not in the class for my two years of my Bible school. And then later, third year, uh, God told me, why you are here? And I said, I'm in the Bible school. Are you doing that? So uh, my grades were so low. But when I came to a realization that I am here for a purpose, then in the last year, I maintained A grade in every subject. And while I was graduating, I was the best pass out. Uh, so I wish you all the success. And when God calls us, he gives us a commandment and a commission. So the commission is one. And the commission giver is one. The commission is go e, yes. and so when I came out of the college, I I wanted to do something. I was assisting my dad. It was like, is this why I'm called? It's like that. Uh, the Bible school is where God speaks to us about our future, and uh, that uh, that is where God gives us vision and He He confirms our our call. So. This place is, this ground is very important in our life. Um, never take it for granted because we don't know when God is going to talk to us. So I, I went, so I, I, I went to my studies again for two years. I completed my master's in psychology and then I, 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 I came back. And I started ministering with my dad, my, but my God told me that you have to go. And then in the past six years, uh, I've been planting churches in India. So over six years, God has enabled me to plant 62 churches so far. Though we have our, uh, other churches in our, uh, in our country, which was planted by my dad. It's all about like 150, 160 churches now. God has been ex establishing our ministry. Learning, uh, see, everyone has different calls. Everyone cannot become professor like uh, Dr. Francis. Everyone cannot plant churches. Everyone cannot hold a, a, a pastorship. Everyone cannot be an evangelist. You know, uh, 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 you know, everyone cannot speak in a crusade like Benny Hinn, you know. Everyone has different call, but we all are called for one purpose. So have that in mind. And when we have that uh, intention so strong in us, we can move forward. And no storms can stop us. And we read in uh, Acts chapter 27, we see... Paul is traveling from one place to another. The ship is, uh, is stuck in a storm. And we see uh, there is storms around. They cannot move. And the ship is about to wreck. Ship is about to broke. And uh, you know Paul in the midst of 276 persons. He was a special man. And they don't know because of this person. 
this one man, all of them are going to be saved. And uh, we have to decide, are we one, are we just one among those 276? Or are we going to be the savior among that 276 people? So in our life, there are many storms which we cannot see in the ministry. But we, we get so upset with many storms. Uh, this is the word that God is placing me in, uh, in my heart. That you may go through storms. But the, the presence of a storm does not indicate that God is not with you. It doesn't mean God is absence. Uh, uh, but God is with you. And as Paul, Paul was uh, instructed by the angel of the Lord. Saying that nobody in the ship will be dying. And then uh, when the ship got broke. Everyone were able to go and reach the uh, other side. And the island is called Malta. We all know. And one, verse, uh, one word that uh, I, can, I can clearly say that it is so powerful. Many have aborted small pieces of the ship which is broken. And some have uh, got cling to the small, small things, whatever they can have to float themselves towards the shore. Uh, uh, never forget that God has not promised us uh, for the ship, but for our life. So many a times we, we stick on to the ship. Oh, uh, this is what God has given me to cross the, cross the line, you know, cross the border, uh, reach our destiny. But no, God has promised our life. So whatever the situation may be, live with what we have. But the destination is going to be there for us, waiting for us. And we will not die before reaching our destination. And have that affirmation that as like Paul had, let's have the heart of, 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 of gospel reaching out. Though we learn many things, though we have PhDs, you know, you know uh, Dr. Francis is having his PhDs, PhDs, right? But he's a very humble man. That is why God is using him to, to, to go beyond the boundaries and reach out to other students, other colleges. And uh, uh, let's remain faithful and be humble. And the ministry that we do in India is establishing just because uh, we are available to reach out to the unreached. The people group that we go I have reached over 22 language speaking people uh, to many different tribal villages and tribal forest that we have uh, went and you know plant church churches the churches that we have is not so big fancy and you know uh, it's not uh, so modern ha uh, it doesn't have an instrument or you know pa system but we have a place of worship where there is no place of worship at all we, have a, we take a survey before planting a church. Uh, before planting a church, we see if there is any church in the dia of, uh, of ten, at least 10 miles. We don't want to have any other churches nearby. We want to plant churches where there is no church at all. And after we reach out to them, many we, pastors we come. Accompany, accompany them. We, we go with them uh, with a friendship uh, and we could reach more people. For, uh, for us, we, 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 we don't have a call for, uh, for a mega church or, you know, people doesn't matter for us. We need church to be planted everywhere. So... Have, uh, have the, the ministry in India in your prayers. God is doing marvelous things. We are reaching, we are, we are having a goal to reach at least 100 churches in the next coming year. Please have it in your prayer because I, I, I set a plan uh, before two years, two, three years, that uh, uh, by the end of 2023, I should at least plant 50 churches. But God has enabled us to plant 62 churches. So God has, has a plan far away from me. So we set a goal 
but uh, God is having his own plan. So may God's will be done in India and even in Kenya we plant church. Uh, we have our church in Kisi. Uh, many people might know Kisi County. We reach in Mogunga, Karoka. So uh, God is doing marvelous things. Well, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, we also have a Bible school back in uh, our organization. Uh, it is called uh, Sharon, Sharon Institute of Theology, where my brother is the principal. I, I just teach like a couple of subjects. Uh, I just teach counseling, pastoral counseling, and, uh, uh, and uh, ethical studies, Christian ethics. So uh, we have like bachelors and masters in divinity. But as we were talking to Dr. Uh, Francis, we wanted to, we were actually consulting with him how we can bring doctorate studies, doctoral studies in India, in our, our own organization. So if God's willing, uh, we will also be accompanying uh, Fulbright Theological Seminary. Uh, God bless you all. Stay blessed. The easiest and most convenient way to send money from UK, EU, US, Canada, and UAE to Africa, Asia, the Caribbean, and Latin America at a great rate with fast transfers to mobile money wallets on popular networks, use Tap Tap Send, the best app to send money from your smartphone anytime. We are giving you an extra $20 bonus for sending any amount above $50 on your first transfer. Then use the promo code Kiari Prestige to claim the bonus. You can send directly to recipient's bank account or M-Pesa number. Join thousands of people worldwide who use Tap Tap Send app. It's simple. Tap Tap and send. Our NMLS ID is 2108069. 2108069. First things first. Go to App Store or Play Store and download Tap Tap Send Money Transfer app and you are ready to go. Remember to use the promo code Kiaria Prestige to demand your bonus. Tap Tap Send. Easy, simple, and fast. You are watching Pacific Waves Television USA, a place of nourishment. Pacific.